So something I like to do is find some things off the internet to, uh, I, I guess they call these reacts, but really I want to find something and make these things useful because there's a ton of these little like 60 second things on Instagram and TikTok and YouTube shorts and stuff. And, and I want to try to pull something useful out. So that's what we're doing here. And we call it the debrief. So let's go with this first one. You just have to be able to do it once to see that it works. There's a quote that I heard that meant a lot to me, which was fear is a mile wide and an inch deep. If you just take the first step, you're like, it's a fucking puddle. I can just skip through it. But I think most people think it's like the Bermuda Triangle. It's usually not as bad as we think. You just. So this is uh, Lila Hormozzi. Um, we worked with an early version of their company way back uh, early on in our in the early days of the gym. And they were very successful in helping um, grow that gym. And she's very smart. She gets overshadowed, I think, by her husband, Alex Hormozzi. She has a lot of stuff on the internet as well, and which I think is very um, useful as well. So you should look into her. But this thing about fear, and we've been talking about fear a lot on the show here. And I think that... that it's very poignant to so this is Lila Hormozzi and she gets overshadowed by her husband Alex Hormozzi a lot if you're on the internet at all you've probably seen his stuff but she has an equal amount of good stuff and this discussion about fear um yeah, let's listen to it. You have to be able to do it once to see that it works. There's a quote that I heard that meant a lot to me, which was, fear is a mile wide and an inch deep. If you what a great quote. Fear is a mile wide and an inch deep. Fear is more scary before you get started. <laughs> you just take the first step. You're like, it's a fucking puddle. I can just skip through it. But I think most people think it's like the Bermuda Triangle. It's Right, we think that usually not when we start something new and then it's going to go bad we're scared of it because we think it's so uh, binary we think it's all uh you know yes or no and you know life doesn't work like that does it life is a series of gray areas where <laughs> you know you can you can try something and it may not work out for you and you can try something else and it's all good and i think that's her point here and i think it's a good point